There is something to be said for how easy it was to convince almost 300 middle school students to leave their air-conditioned classrooms Stop shooting. Stop shooting. on one of the hottest days of the year one shot, one shot to, to march for a cause they believe in, ending gun violence. <laughs> this was the scene in Crown Heights, Brooklyn, as students at the Launch Expeditionary Learning Charter School took to the streets Friday afternoon and marched several blocks to Restoration Plaza in neighboring bed -Stuy. This march, one of many taking place across the city and the country in honor of National Gun Violence Awareness Day, the color orange chosen as a symbol of safety. It's the color hunters choose to wear in the woods to avoid becoming a target. But for several students here, including LaVon Walker, I lost one of my loved ones to gun violence. This outing is personal. My father. And you lost your father. Uh huh. When was this? Uh, 2016. I wanted to end, like, extreme, like, right, 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 right now. A spokesperson for the Brooklyn DA's office tells PIX11 News the number of shooting victims, regardless of age, continues to decline. From 544 victims in the borough last year to 189 people shot in the first five months of this year. For a big picture view of how gun violence is specifically affecting New York City's youth, 18 and younger, we reached out to the NYPD. That data is more concerning. Between 2020, 21, and 22, during the height of the coronavirus pandemic and its aftermath, the department documented a steady increase in the number of youth and teens getting shot. In 2020, during the pandemic, I lost my brother to gun violence. Launch Charter co-principal Shamika Kenlock. I think it's in the media. It's in the music they listen to, it's in the, vid the video games they play, the movies they watch. I think it's extremely urgent for our students to have a voice on this issue. My cousin Daryl, he died about two years ago. And when I found out he died, it really broke my heart. And I was so young at the age, I didn't know what was going on. And that really changed about my outcome about gun violence.